welcome to day five of the flats and hand washing challenge um today's topic prompt whatever um is actually open topic so i decided that since i had everything clean um that i was just going to talk about each different type of cloth diaper that i have anyway um so we're just gonna get straight into it because i don't want this to be this long drawn out video, <laughs> this is actually my second time taping it, trying to make it even shorter than what it was. So the first type I want to talk about are covers because of course this week we're using flats and covers. Um, so what a cover is, is basically just a layer of PUL or TPU. So PUL is a chemical process and then TPU is like a heat process of making the, um, the material, right? Um, but they both do the same thing. It's just some companies use P well, some use TPU. So anyway, and the way you use a cover is you can put a prefold into it. And so what a lot of people like about prefold about covers is that they can be used multiple times. So with a lot of other different types of cloth diapers, once you use it, it has to go into the dirty diapers, right? But with a cover, you can reuse it a few times or you can reuse it throughout the day. And then maybe at the end of the night, you can put it with the dirty diapers. Because with a cover, you can take a prefold and you put it in there and then you wrap this around baby. And then baby pees or poops. So then you take the diaper off, you take this prefold out. If it's a little damp, you can just like wipe it off and then you can sit it to the side and if it isn't wet at all, you can just reuse it. So you would just take your prefold or your flat or your fitted, whatever you're putting in here, and you can just use this same one again. Now, most of the time, if baby poops, most people would just go on ahead and take the whole thing and put it with the dirty diapers as well. Some people choose to use it as long as it doesn't smell and as long as no poop got on it. You also wanna go on ahead and put it into your dirty diapers if it's saturated and so you'll know because like all of this right here this it will be wet and i did not experience that until this challenge and i was like so that's what a saturated cover feels like so yeah you'll know if you can reuse it and you'll know if you don't and you can always smell it you can touch it and you know like i said you can sit it to the side if you want to come back to it you can reuse it right then or you can just throw it in the dirty diaper pail with all the other diapers it's completely up to you. So that's how covers work. The next kind is gonna be um, a fitted diaper. So I have two different types of fitted diapers. I have regular, I have like a regular fitted, and then I have a hybrid fitted. So a regular fitted, basically what this means is I have to have something that covers this because over time, and we use this at night, so I could not even try to let him go without something over this because the entire thing is absorbent. So that means the entire thing gets wet, okay? So with something like this, you could either put a wool cover over or you could put a cover over it. So I use covers because I don't have any wool, but, but fitteds have, most of them, some don't, but most of them have like, you know a good bit of absorbency in them and with this one it snaps in and it's got like you know the two flaps this is a sloom and um so i normally fold this down here because he pees a lot in the front and then i fold this piece over so that more of the absorbency is up here at the front and it keeps the rest of it from getting wet you know a little bit longer so like i said just put a cover over it and then the other kind is going to be a uh, hybrid fitted. So with a hybrid fitted, what that means is, and of course they have a lot of absorbency in them as well. And I'll leave links to all the ones that I like bring up in the video. But this one is from Snappy Greens and I love, I love her company. But anyway, um, so with a hybrid fitted, you can put this on baby. And like, if you're just gonna use it like during the day for like a couple of hours, you don't have to put anything over this. It won't get wet. Um, but if you're gonna use it like at nap time or if you're gonna use it overnight like I do, then once again, you wanna put something over this, whether it's a cover or a wool cover. So that's how a hybrid fitted works. And the next kind of diaper is gonna be a pocket diaper. So pocket diapers, 
it basically mean okay i have no idea what happened <laughs> it was telling me my battery was up um so i may have to fix this but we'll see but with a pocket diaper it basically means that the absorbency goes inside of the pocket pretty simple this is most people's favorite kind because it's just i guess easier to understand in a sense so you put the insert inside baby uses it and then when baby's done you pull the insert out and all of this goes into the dirty diapers even if you put your absorbency on top of your pocket you still want to probably just chunk the whole thing once it's dirty because more than likely if you're if all of your absorbency is wet by the time you take it out um or it's what you know when you go to change baby then this is probably wet too at least underneath it or that means it's got pee it got like pee on it because this is a stay dry layer so even though it may not feel wet to the touch it doesn't mean that it doesn't have pee in it so with a cover you can just wipe it with a wipe and let it dry and you get every, you know whatever's on it is off of it but with this you have this material so the material may dry but that doesn't mean that there's not still pee like on it so it's recommended that if you use pocket diapers even if you put your absorbency on it then you would just want to put everything in a dirty diaper pail but some people choose not to and that's completely fine all in twos means that they can be used two different ways so most ways that all in twos are used is either as a cover or as a pocket diaper so with this all in two this one is from bottoms up junior i have it stuffed like i would a pocket diaper so the absorbency is inside but the lining on this diaper i've actually done a review on it is athletic wicking jersey and so it's easy to clean it dries you know really quickly and you can like wipe this off if you wanted to but you can take the insert out and you would just throw this in the dirty diaper thing if you used it as a pocket but if you didn't and you use it as a cover that means that you would have the absorbency on top so then when baby use this you would just take this out and then you could just put another one on top and then that would be you essentially using it as a cover and then the last type that we're going to talk about is going to be an all-in-one so an all-in-one means that the absorbency i say is sewn into the diaper or sewn onto the diaper in some sort of way so with some of them the the absorbency may be sewn like into it and then with some diapers the absorbency is sewn onto it so like this is flaps and this one's from west coast Diapers. so you can see that it's on there like that and then with some it's sewn on so like this is a blueberry diaper but this is cotton and so this is absorbent and it's sewn completely onto the diaper and then it also has this extra piece of cotton with the stage dry fleece and so with this kind of diaper you can either lay this on here or you can tuck it in but it's all still one piece so once baby uses this you take it and it goes into the dirty diapers so those are most of the ones that i use and of course i have different types of pocket diapers i have different types of all-in-ones and stuff like that but that's mostly like the gist of how you know an all-in-one works what is a pocket diaper what is a cover how to use a cover and stuff like that so i figured it would be helpful because i remember when i first got started or right before i got started and i was just like really overwhelmed trying to figure out what all these different you know names were and types were so i just kind of wanted to run through those and just kind of show how you can use them so hopefully you found this helpful um, if you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe. Um, please like this video and y'all can comment and let me know like what other kind of videos y'all maybe want me to do.
at some point um because i have a lot of ideas but it'll be better if y'all maybe like gave me ideas too <laughs> but um yeah i will see y'all later <laughs>